Hello friends, this is Keith, and today we are going to be taking a look at Theme Boosters, a sweet new product for Magic the Gathering. Theme Boosters are semi-randomized packs of 35 cards that are meant to give players a chance of finding cards in certain colors or themes that they would otherwise have a much more difficult time getting from just opening regular booster packs. So from this set, Guilds of Ravnica, the theme boosters are split by each of the 10 two-color combinations of Ravnica's guilds. You've got Boros's red-white, Selesnya's green-white, Golgari's black-green, Demir's blue-black, and Izzet's blue-red. Each pack comes with a rare or mythic, along with other cards only related to the specified guild. The back of the package even suggests adding 25 lands instantly making a 60 card deck for you to enjoy. Theme boosters are about the price of a couple boosters and they're available all over the dang place. So with that in mind, let's go ahead and open it. And maybe, if we're lucky, we'll get an Assassin's Trophy. So inside the booster, you've got this little uh, guild logo, which is pretty cool looking. And then you've got the 35 cards, starting with some commons and uncommons. So, starting out, we've got a Vigor Spore Worm, Grappling Sundew, District Guide, Affectionate Indrik, Hired Poisoner, Devcaran Dissident, Iron Shell Beetle, Golgari Locket. You've got a Necrotic Wound, Crawl Foragers, another Vigor Spore Worm, Golgari Raiders, Crawl Harpooner, Pitiless Gorgon, Porcullus Vine, Burglar Rat, Iron Shell Beetle, Spinal Centipede, Wary Okapi, Bartisan Bats, Wild Ceratoc, Dowser of Lights, Silent Dart, Molder Hulk, which is a freaking. Ugh, like all these, seriously, all these Golgari cards, like when people are able to cast them in Limited, they just end up being bombs. It's kind of stupid. <laughs> You've got Status and Statue. You've got Swarm Guild Mage. Another Burglar Rat. Ocran Assassin, which is also a pretty nuts card. Prey Upon. Mulder Hulk. Another one. <laughs> Another Status and Statue. Gatekeeper Gargoyle. Another Pitiless Gorgon. Undercity Uprising, and a Beast Whisperer, a pretty cool elf. It's two green and two. It's an elf druid. Whenever you cast a creature spell, draw a card, and it's a 2-3. This is reminiscent of a card that's used in the Legacy Elf deck, Glimpse of Nature. It's a one green sorcery that does this same effect for the remainder of your turn. So it's a pretty cool card. And then we have an advertisement card, advertising a Magic the Gathering app on one side, and Magic the Gathering Arena on the other side, offering a code for three free booster packs, which is pretty cool. So, all in all, this is pretty neat. I would definitely say that it looks like it's fun to add the 25 lands, like it suggests, to play with a friend. Definitely if they also have a theme, a theme booster pack. So yeah, all in all, it's pretty neat, and I would say go ahead and buy one if you're wanting to pick up some commons and uncommons for the guild that you want. So, thank you for watching. Feel free to like and subscribe, or leave a comment. It would all be very much appreciated. And yeah, thanks. I'll be back next time.